Uh, thank you, guys. It's one of the world's most popular new musicals taking over Broadway and London's West End. And Juliet flips the script and on Shakespeare's most famous love story. Juliet plunges Romeo's dagger into her heart. What if Juliet didn't kill herself? <laughs> I mean, really, that should almost be the start of the play. knew that song was Shakespearean, <laughs> but yes, that makes sense now. Now it makes sense. Now the hit production is making its way to Australia and the all-star cast has been announced featuring Rob Mills and the one and only Casey Donovan. Hello, Casey. Thanks for joining us. Hey, joining us this morning from Melbourne, from our Melbourne studio. Welcome back to The Morning Show. Thank we'll talk about much. the musical in just a second. It looks amazing. And you look amazing too. How do oh, you feel? Thank you. you look absolutely fantastic. Oh, thank you very much. All the... Health. <laughs> thank you very much and thank you very much to Jenny Craig. Um, I have been absolutely living and loving my life and just trying all the new healthy things and Jenny Craig has been an amazing part of, of life in the last few months and look at that face look, look at, at her you. she's so happy but um no jenny craig has been absolutely amazing and i'm loving every minute it's just simply simply easy isn't it oh, there she is good on you casey you, you look great now congratulations also oh, on your tribute to yeah. judith durham at the aria oh. awards it was a knockout was it nerve-wracking to take on such a big hit the seekers hit it really was and you know I think the one thing when you're doing the in memoriam section of shows is to just pay respect to the artist and you know breathe through it and know that you're carrying on memories of of this music and this beautiful woman so uh, it's a, a very stunning song and it was yeah it's always very nerve-wracking when you've got mm. you know a very heavy weight on your shoulders but it was such a beautiful moment and yeah it was yeah it was yeah, one of those moments that just light up. It was amazing. Spine oh, thank you very stuff. much. We, we lost, you know, so many greats this year and it was, yeah, mm. a beautiful, a beautiful part beautiful, of the Aries yeah. also to celebrate them. Now, Aww. Casey, I've got to ask, you're from a Sydney side, but you've made the move to Melbourne. How's the change <laughs> of scenery going? <laughs> Look, the chain, change of scenery has been absolutely amazing. I am loving Melbourne. I've just moved back up into Melbourne, which has been really, really great. Um, I, yeah... Sydney born and bred and mm. moved down here in COVID thinking that Melbourne would be the first thing to open back up once we got out of the pandemic. Mm. Sorely wrong. Uh, <laughs> but no, it's been great. It's been amazing. It's so great to get back out there in the arts and I'm so excited to be bringing Anne Juliet along with a lot of other, my other very, very good friends here to the Regent Theatre next year. Yeah. Uh, talk yeah. us through Anne Juliet and I love the way you're such a pro. You just go from <laughs> one of your projects to another, which means we now have to ask you about Anne Juliet. So anyway, tell us all about Anne Juliet. It looks amazing. Look, I am so excited to be part of this all-star cast. It's going to be amazing. It's diverse, it's exciting, it's the story of what Juliet would do if she didn't die. And that I think is very, very exciting and it's such an amazing cast. I mean, look at all of these amazing people. Um, it's going to be great. I'm so excited to be playing the role of Angelique um, and get to play alongside my best mate, Rob Mills. Um, it's just going to be amazing. It's a new musical, it's fun, it's the music of Max Martin. David West Reed is the writer and he's the writer of Shit's Creek as well. So it's going to be absolutely oh, amazing to be part of this cast. Everybody. There is, look at all this. It's so much fun. It's bright, yeah. it's light and the music is absolutely Absolutely don't, banging. So don't tell I us. Can't wait. Don't tell us exactly what Juliet would have done if she didn't die. But just tell us: Would she have been on the Titanic or not? Oh, oh gosh. No, oh, no. Look, no, it, no. I, I don't think, think you're so. going to say would she be on TikTok because this oh, looks look, like a very modern-day version of Juliet. Yeah, I feel like she really would be. Yeah, she would definitely be on TikTok. She would be all over TikTok. She'd be just posting content left, right, all the time, all the time, all of the TikToks. Yeah, Romeo, Romeo. Casey, we're not far off Christmas, obviously, if you haven't heard. <laughs> it's everywhere at the I moment. Know. I feel like it we're really going into Christmas meltdown. How are you spending your holiday season? Look, I'm working. Um, I feel like I've just, you know, come off the back of nine to five and then got back into my normal kind of, you know, hectic life. And now we're coming into the, the silly season and the beautiful season that is Christmas about, you know, people coming together and celebrating with friends and family and those you hold nearest and dearest. And Christmas for me is, you know, it's trying to get as much sleep as I can, but yeah. also celebrating through song, you know, um, doing the carols down here in Melbourne. And I'm looking very much forward to just getting out there and, and having a little bit of downtime 
time when I can squeeze some in. But yeah, I mean, Christmas is going to be great. Do and people expect it's you? Yeah. When, when you're at a Christmas function, do people expect you to do the carols. the carols when you're at a family and friends? Yeah, the thing? jingle bells. No, no, no. I feel like they've they've understood the assignment. On you know, I'm there to just sit and just rejoice and relax. Um, you know, if I do get up and get a bit merry um, on some Christmas punch, who knows what can happen? The karaoke is never too far away in any household that I'm in. But um, <laughs> yeah, look, it's always just nice to just sit back and relax and feel like I'm not working for a day. Great. Gosh. Uh, lovely to see you. You've got so many great things going on. Oh, thank you so much. And thank you so much for having me. I hope you have a very Merry Christmas and a happy and safe New Year. Aww. And yeah, and check yeah. out my socials. Um, yeah, I feel like I'm everywhere at the minute. Right. It's great. And we are yeah. happy to see you everywhere at the minute. You're doing so much more so socials than Juliet at this yeah, point. Yeah, she needs to lick her TikTok in game. Yes. Oh, she's, she, she, she will be. Romeo, Romeo, swipe right now, Romeo. <laughs> Juliet, thank, um, thank you, Casey. And Juliet opens at the Regent Theatre in Melbourne from uh, February next year. It's going to be great. Well,